Those of you new to rabbits and you're debating what type of hay, I know everybody talks about second cut hay, but there's also third cut hay. So there's actually first cut, second cut, and third cut. So second cut is the most popular because it's the middle part of the stalk. So this is third cut. This is the most bottom part of the stalk, uh, the closest to the ground. So here's a sample. It's actually very soft and it's very short. So it's not as long as first cut. A second cut is the middle, and this is third cut. So honey really likes third cut hay. This batch of third cut is much longer than I am used to. Normally it's like this size for third cut hay, but there are several pieces which is like really long, almost like first cut length. So every batch is always a little different but you can tell it's not as green. First cut tends to be much greener because it's the higher part of the stalk. And the third cut tends to have a little bit more brown pieces. And then Honeydew over there is also enjoying his piece of third cut. And the reason we do a variety of hay, like first cut, second cut, third cut, is because honey tends to be very picky. We used to, when we first got her, only purchase second cut hay, and then she kind of got bored of it, so we had to get more creative with our hay. And here's first cut hay. So here's first cut hay with high fiber and more stems. So let me open this up. So if you see hay that's a lot like this, with a lot of tops, this is the top of the stalk of hay, that's how you know you got yourself some first cut. And this tends to be a lot thicker than the second and third cut. So these are much thicker hay, which is actually great for stuffing into those little circle balls, hay balls, because these are so thick, they can hold their own, they won't just fall out. So first cut hay is great for stuffing into hay balls and toys too. Here is a bag of orchard hay. Orchard hay is a hypoallergenic hay but it, it's different. It's soft, like second cut, but it's also long, like first cut. So it's a different type of hay. And my bunnies love orchard hay for their bedding. So that is why not only do they like eating it because, you know, it tastes good, but it also is very, very soft and it's great for bedding too. So orchard hay is an all around excellent hay. It's different than Timothy hay. At the bottom here, you can notice that's orchard hay that we mentioned before. On the top here, that's a combination of oat and barley hay that we got from the local rabbit rescue store. And then if you take a look over here, this is the oxbow oat hay. The oxbow oat hay is much smaller. It's still oat hay, but you can tell it's much smaller and it works really well for the little hay feeders. When you get the big giant bags from the rabbit rescue stores, they tend to have much longer hay stalks, which is great, especially when you have the larger hay feeders. So this is how long the hay stalks are. They're quite long. This is like almost 12 inches long. And it's great. And that's one of the smaller pieces. There are pieces in there that I had to fold in half just to fit into the hay feeder. So those are sometimes two feet long, which is great because that gives them plenty of time to chew through the stalks, which will also help grind down their teeth. Honeydew really loves the oat and barley. So there is more to hay than just Timothy hay. And definitely check out your local rabbit rescue stores because they tend to offer really good bargains when it comes to the hay that they carry. And they always seem to get them fresh daily. So you don't have to go onto the internet on Amazon to buy hay. Although that's a great place to buy hay as well. But if you have larger rabbits like ours, ours is like four and a half pound rabbits and we got two of them. They're gonna eat a lot more than the miniature rabbits. So at the end, it comes down to the type of rabbits you have, how big they are. Because at the end of the day, we are feeding two rabbits 
and the total weight between the two of them is about nine pounds to 10 pounds. And they're definitely gonna eat way more hay than the dwarf rabbits. Definitely something to consider if you are new to rabbit ownership, that there is a lot more different types of hay out there that they can eat besides just Timothy hay. The one thing you just gotta be careful is don't feed them alfalfa, especially after they become adults. Alfalfa hay is used only for baby bunnies because they still need the nutrients. But adult bunnies should not be eating alfalfa. Okay, so we are going to be finishing up the hay video. So yes, that's right. We're gonna wrap up the hay video. And I just wanna show you all the hay that we have. And just a reminder, if you have dwarf rabbits, you definitely don't need this much hay. A six pound bag of Timothy hay right here. This is a six pound bag of oat and barley hay over here. Uh, this is lovegrass. And over here is their favorite, it's their orchard hay in this bag. And this one's only a three pound bag and orchard hay is again hypoallergenic. But you don't have to get big giant bags like this, especially if you just have one single dwarf rabbit or if you have multiple small dwarf rabbits. You can go to the internet like Amazon and buy Oxbow. Oxbow has nice little one pound bags like this and they have many different varieties. Uh, we have tried at least three varieties from Amazon for Oxbow and I know this is their favorite, organic meadow hay. Organic metal hay is really tiny, it's short, it's small, and they love it because it's delicious. To me, it kind of is like an in-between of second cut hay and third cut Timothy hay when it comes to this type of metal hay. So it's really nice, it's soft, and it's very yummy. Right, honey? You love eating it. And we normally put the Oxbow metal hay inside their little hay feeder and we don't put it inside their litter box. So these big giant bags here is what we use in their litter box because one type of hay is not good enough for honey because she gets bored of hay if it's just only one type. So we keep it as a variety and it keeps her coming back to eating her hay and keeping her away from other junk food like eating too much fruit Yeah, she loves her carrots. So keeping the hay variety going turns her attention away from eating too much of her other snacks, especially pellets. When we first got her, we fed her a lot of pellets and now we have weaned her pretty much off the pellet diet. All right, so there is, what kind of hay is that in that bag? Orchard. Orchard, okay. Uh, orchard is not the first layer to the litter box. Remember, it's love grass. So come over here and grab the love grass. Okay. So love grass is the bottom layer for us because they don't like sitting in love grass. Okay, so open that up and show the camera. So go ahead, take it out. You can kind of see love grass is really thin. It's very thin, very dry, very short. Put it in. But they do tend to stick to each other. Yeah. It sticks together. It kind of clumps. Yeah, that's a lot. Yeah, it's a lot. So it kind of is one big giant clump. It's almost like a tumbleweed. Yeah. And you just got to flatten it out. Okay. So it's great for nesting, especially as a bottom layer. Yep. All right, so next comes the orchard layer. So this is the orchard hay layer. They're longer stalks and a bit grippy if you put your finger in a certain direction. Orchard hay also smells really nice too. And it's fluffy. And it's very fluffy grass. All right, I think that's good. Yep. Okay, and that will last about two and a half, three days. Yeah. Because we change it every other day for two rabbits. Because again, if you combine the weight of two rabbits, it adds up to about 10 pounds. And that is why we go through so much hay. 
this is probably gonna last us only like a month or two. All this hay is only gonna last us a month or two with these two rabbits. And they really clean it out. They really love their hay. Yeah? Right, honey bun? You love your hay. Oh, here comes Honeydew. He's like, what's going on? Is it free for all for hay? <laughs> yeah, I just got him back. From the sofa. There. Yeah, you just well, got him back. Well, he was underneath the sofa. He was where um, my Barbies were. Oh, yeah. he was hanging around your Barbies? Right, Honeydew? You were playing with Barbies? <laughs> When we were at the store and we purchased the Timothy hay, they don't label it as first cut, second cut, or third cut, but go ahead and pick up some of the hay. Once you know your cuts, you can easily tell that this is first cut hay. And this is a nice six pound bag of first cut hay because first cut tends to be longer stalks and you can see these wonderful little tufts. tufts. So that's really, really awesome because the tufts is what the rabbits love. All right, so and we're gonna put that into their hay feeder. All right. Yeah. Wow. Okay, so in their hay feeder, we have a combination of oat and barley because they love the taste of oat and barley and more first cut. There we go. I think it's good. Yeah, that's definitely. Okay. okay, bye everyone, and I hope you found this video helpful, and please subscribe and give this a